Okay, so we're gonna do the vehicle ones. Brew back a vehicle. Okay, this one is down here. Yep. I just need to drive there. Basically. Oh god, this car's too fast! <laughs> ah, this thing. Oh my god, this car's crazy, man. Again, there's a reason why they call it the crazy horse. Oh my god. <laughs> this thing's too fast! Oh lord. No! No! We've got a roadblock set up. Shoot slow down. Want some more? Oh, jeez. I'm almost dead, dude. <laughs> I'm almost killing myself just from crashing the thing. Let alone the police that are shooting me. Okay, so this thing can kind of drift around corners. Just gotta use handbrake turning. Alright. Oh! <laughs> Alright, we're going back to the Batmobile. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, dude. <laughs> Just got straight up taken out by a tram. Oh, man. Amazing. Oh, yeah, dude. That would have completely derailed that tram. Actually, I prefer, I prefer the uh, completely out of place muscle car. There we go. There we go. Hey, thank you for the host. Great, appreciate it. How's it going, guys? Is that doing my dashboard up? We're gonna see who it was. Just uh, currently doing all the phone booth missions to get a couple of extra vehicles. Oh, it's the Corona. Hey, man, how's it doing? Yeah, man, it's going all right. We're really close to getting the Platinum Trophy for this game. I'm just uh, doing some phone booth missions to get... Uh, I've got four more vehicles for my collection. And then we've got to collect all 50 foxes. And then we're done. So, yeah. See, I'm trying trying to get this 100 percented today. Well, I mean, we're gonna get 100 percent today. I can almost guarantee it, unless something very bad happens. <laughs> uh, and then tomorrow we've got Crash Four, so yeah. How about you, man? How have you been? What have you been playing lately? I've been out of it the last week and a bit because I've been sick. So I've just been like, if I'm not streaming, I'm like either sleep. I'm basically, if I'm not streaming, I've been basically asleep. I sleep. I've been sick, so yeah. Please send some officers down here now. Officers downtown. Oh man. Hey, Lega, how's it going, man? How you doing? 
But yeah, so basically, like, these phone booth missions, we have to, like, go to these specific phone booths around town and answer the call there. And that gives us the phone booth mission and then unlock extra special things. Uh, oh, you mean 3 door size? Yeah, dude, nice. Uh, which one have you have you beaten any of them yet? Any of the games in 3D or size? Yeah, Rocket League went free to play. I'm I'm keen to get back into that at some point. Cause uh pretty pretty easy platinum trophy for that game as well. Relatively. It would be fun to play that again sometime. There's so many new releases, dude, it's insane. Beat 64, now doing Mario Galaxy. Nice. Oh, yeah. If I was into Mario, I'd probably get it. But I'm not, honestly not that into Mario. But also, there's just so many new releases all the time, man. Like, it's... Yeah, not enough time to check out a lot of other stuff. Besides new releases that I'm already interested in. Uh, your adventures at the track inspired me to dabble in some race fixing, take the cars I provide and swap them across town. If you bring the last car back in good time, it's all yours. Um, it didn't say anything about not damaging them, so hopefully this one, I can crash it a little bit. <laughs> Maybe. Wait, is that the car right there? Oh, hello. So what the hell is that thing? Uh, that's all good, man. I appreciate it. I appreciate the host slash raid. Either way, dude. Yeah, you take care of yourself. Uh, hopefully I'll get to see you, see you live sometime soon. When I'm not, like, asleep. <laughs> because of the sickness. But yeah, man. I appreciate you. Take care, dude. Okay, let me just test it. Can I bump this thing without losing? Okay, I think I can. Cool. Awesome. Not that I'm, not that I'm gonna intentionally crash the car, but at the same time, like the last challenge we had to do was literally do not bump the car at all, or you will lose. How far away is this? Okay, that's not bad at all. I must say, I love this white suit. <laughs> it's pretty sweet. Yeah, the last what the last challenge we did was with the crazy horse cards. It was drag stuff. Awful thing to turn, but if you hit anything with it, you pay all the mission. And it was just like it's super duper fast, like insanely fast, and you could barely turn it. So I was constantly like accelerate brake, accelerate brake, accelerate brake, non-stop. I was trying to race it across town. Off, but uh, it's cool. I, I didn't know that these missions were in the game until I was looking up how to get how to unlock extra cars because there's a trophy for unlocking 30 cars and then they had 25. Unlocked. So I was trying to figure out how we did that. Hey, thank you for following, by the way. Appreciate it. Appreciate it very much. Alright, so we're taking this one. So we put, take this one out of that. And then put the red one up the ring. Okay. Um, okay. Get in the car! Come on, hurry up! Holy crap! Whoa, we got seven minutes to drive this car? Where the hell am I taking it to? Oh, Lord. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, that extra time, I'm gonna drive it like halfway across the halfway across the world. Oh man. Through the bushland. Oh god, it's your nose. 
I'm, I'm getting IRL hay fever from having to drive this car through the bush. Definitely need to use my nasal douche tonight. Yes, I, I call it a nasal douche. It's basically where you, right, where you squirt saline water up your nose. Like disinfected saline water up your nose. And then uh, it like flushes out your sinus. It's gross, but it's very effective if you've got chronic hay fever like I do. Alright, gotta go fast boy, look at this fast boy go, make sure it's saline, yeah, yeah, you definitely don't use tap water, no, you gotta, if you use tap water, you have to boil the crap out of it, and then put the saline in it, like the saline mixture. Brain eating amoebas aside, you, it's, you, you don't want to use not disinfected, un, undisinfected water <laughs> when you're cleaning out your sinus. It's just a bad idea in general. For one, nowhere near as effective. Again, brain eating amoeba aside, <laughs> it's not as effective. <laughs> uh, you know, I mean, a, a, ignoring the issues of brain eating amoebas. <laughs> yeah, you know, it's just not, it's, you gotta use that disinfectant water with the saline in it. Because that's what flushes all the pollutants out, all the pollens and all that shit. And all the, uh, this. It's good fun, man. Gotta love having chronic sinusitis. It's the best. It makes you feel so good and full of energy all the time and super stoked about sneezing non-stop until your body starts aching. It's so good, man. Oh yeah, dude. Sometimes you have like a small child come out when you flush your nose. It's like, how the fuck did that get up in there? I have no idea, dude. At least this car is a fast, reasonably controlling boy, unlike the dragster. Across the dam. I'm gonna drift. Oh god. Almost there. Almost there. <laughs> yeah. WRC Rally. 1930, boy. Wait, what? Hang on. What? I'm gonna swap another car? What? <laughs> what? What is going on? I'm swapping all the cars! Oh boy, the axle chip. <laughs> okay, Oop. that's right, you can only hop in from the left side.
Okay, I've only got four and a half minutes to do this one. Where have I got to drive this one to? Okay, that's not too bad. That's not too bad. Go, 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 go! I'm fast as fuck, boy! Yeah! Exhaust placement? Yeah, dude. Some of these cars are kind of wild with their designs. Dude, I don't know if you've seen it. There's this game on Steam called, uh, it's like Automation Car Company uh, Simulator or something like that, or Tycoon. And like, you, you can fully like design your own cars in it. Like from every, like every part of it. The chassis, the engine, all the individual parts inside of it. Fully custom design them and then like mass manufacture them and sell them. Looks crazy. It looks really crazy, and it's like an early access as well. So they're adding more and more stuff to it, like different engine types. Like like people have made uh like 900 horsepower electric cars and shit. <laughs> oh god, fuck. Go 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 go. It looks awesome. Might have to pick it up at some point. That means I've got so many games already like that then. I'm not in a rush to buy more games. Oh god. I mean, like, Jesus, Jesus Christ, <laughs> after, like, after, um, PS5 comes out, man, like, a week after PS5 is Cyberpunk. Like, we got, we got PS5 plus all the launch games, and then, a week later, Cyberpunk. It's insane. Are you, are you serious? Another switcheroo. <laughs> what? Just the cyberpunk campaign, are they actually? Damn, I wasn't aware of that. Go, go, with a sample group where many couldn't be the Witcher 3. Ah, oh, true. What, because it's too long? Yeah. Ah, fuck. Whew. It's so punk shorter now. Well, I mean, I'd imagine... I'd imagine CD Projekt Red ha probably has pretty in-depth stats on what people have beaten and haven't beaten in that game. Even just from Steam. Like, they'd be able to figure out how many people beat what based on, like, achievements and stuff like that. Right? Because they'd know exactly how many people have each game on each console, on each platform, and then how many of those got each achievement, and blah, 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 blah. Like, I mean, I'd personally prefer, like, a more focused campaign than, like, an extremely long but not focused campaign, if that makes sense. But it's also, like, an open-world RPG, so it's kind of, like, it doesn't need to be super focused. Yeah, I, I don't think it's going to be, I don't think it's going to be lost content. I, I'd imagine it's pro they're probably, like, move, it's probably, like, they're shortening, like, the story campaign but moving stuff that was in the story campaign into side missions. That's what I'd imagine they're doing. 
Which I mean, yeah, whatever. Like, I mean, I'll assume it's still gonna be good either way. Oh god. Man, this is a wild ass mission, eh? We're like gonna drive between each spot and swap cars. How many cars have we swapped? Like four cars? Or something like that? Assuming this is the last one. This is Return to Oakwood, so I'm assuming it's the last one. Dude. <laughs> oh man, I'm gonna oh I'm so keen for cyberpunk, dude. Holy shit. I've got my cyberpunk jacket ready to go. I don't know if you've seen my cyberpunk jacket, but I'll, I wore it in my uh in the cyberpunk video that I did. I've also got my cyberpunk glasses. Like, yeah, I'm keen. All right, sweet. We've unlocked the Brubacker car. Yes. I might have posted it to Instagram as well. Let's see. Like just photos of the jacket. Yeah, I did. Yeah, it's on my Instagram. It's from, like, back in August. Okay, so the next one, Mr. Fancy Bike. Oops. Um, sh Alright, okay, so this one's bike with checkpoints. Okay. Sweet, so yeah, we need to get three more vehicles unlocked, and then we are all good on vehicles and we can start getting the foxes. Yeah, it's, it's a pretty nice jacket, man. Um, yeah, it's pretty nice. I like it. Yeah, man. It's pretty sweet. Let's see, I need to grab. Nice, hell yeah, dude. I would love to like uh, if I if I was good at stitching, I would like put some fucking LEDs in the collar. If I like, if I was good with stitching and also electronics, like designing electronics, I'll do that. Spoiler alert, I didn't make it myself. <laughs> I bought it off Amazon. <laughs> um, ooh, hello. I've, des I've devised a revolutionary motorcycle. All I need you to do is prove sh that she drives as good as she looks. If you're quick, you can keep her. Ooh. This is going to be the bat cycle. Like I've got my... Yeah, basically. <laughs> I've got my Batmobile and then we've got this bad boy that looks like a bat motorbike. Alright, let's go. Hey, look oh boy. Oh shit. <laughs> I just killed myself. <laughs> oh fuck. Look at him. Bit awkward having to ride it on the uh, sidewalk there. <sighs> God, these loading screens make me so keen for PS5. Holy shit. Every time there's a loading screen in, the, in a game, I'm like, God damn it, look, PS5. Give it to me. Give it to me. Alright, let's try it again. Get on! What? Oh my god. Oh, 
Dude, trying to keep this thing going straight is a fucking pain in the ass. This thing's annoying to drive. Holy crap. <laughs> it's actually awful to drive. What the fuck? Oh, man. What are you doing? Okay. Watch for the guy on the motorcycle. Motorcycle coming through. Run for your life. Oh my god, stop. Oh! Wow, you need to go way faster, I guess. Alright, let's try it again. Come on. Uh. Yeah, that's not happening. That's annoying. Go up. Oh, you piece of shit. Uh, yep, this motorcycle sucks. Holy crap. It's like actually worse than the other motorcycle. Because <laughs> of the way it's designed, it can't go up fucking stairs like that. The other motorcycle you get from the beginning of the game, way better than that. <laughs> way better. It's a shame, because it looks awesome, it just drives like a piece of shit. Uh, okay. But it looks futuristic. <laughs> but it drives like a piece of shit. Okay. Let's try, try that again. It's just like, it's just a pain in the ass to keep it driving straight. That's the problem it has. Like. Oh God. Huh? Let's try that again. All right, here we go. Go. Okay. <laughs> so, oh man, it's so annoying to drive. It's like you gotta like you gotta make these micro adjustments as you're driving to keep it straight. Okay, come on. Yeah, let me go down here. I gotta get get a good speed up to make that jump. Buddy, if you ain't if you ain't out of control, you ain't in control. Oh you fuck! Oh come on! Oh you piece of shit. Alright, I'll have to take the long way around then. Come on, get up! Serious? Come on! The fuck? Dude, I. F okay. 
this sucks. Holy shit. This sucks so much. Just like, hit the thing. Oh, go too far to the left. I can't do it, Captain. I can't hit it. You need to go further to the right. But there's a pole on the way. Go further to the right. Uh. <sighs> All right. Let's go. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Let's go. All right. Nope, don't. You s <laughs> I'm just like, no. Keep on the course, buddy. I hit it at a bump, though. Go straight. Why is it going like that? Because this bike controller is like a piece of shit. That's why. Guy in the bike's crazy, man. Oh, God. Kind of reminds me of the bike from Final Fantasy VII that Cloud has. Kind of. Just less, like, exhaust pipes. Okay. Let's go. Come on, don't be a little bitch. What, what did I even hit there? What did I even hit? I have no idea what I just hit there. Oh my lord. <sighs> this sucks, man. Come on. Just need like eight man sized swords tucked away in it. Yeah, dude. <laughs> oh, man. What? <laughs> God damn it. Run for your life. Run as fast as you can. Oh. <laughs> I don't even know what I hit when I tried to do that jump. I like went sideways kind of and just went off the edge. Uh, <laughs> I might just skip this one, honestly. I might just skip it and just do a different one. And then just get collect a random vehicle off the street that I don't have. It's just very, it's just very frustrating to try to do this. Just that, just that one little jump is just awful. Like, there's so much little crap in the way, and you gotta do so many, so many micro adjustments with this bike to keep it going straight. Just like, oh, please, plus. And plus, it jumps garbage anyway, because you, you gotta like hit it at a weird angle so that you go to the right. But there's like a pole block in the normal way that you just jump to that jump to hit right, so you have to like spin in the air to hit it. It's so weird. Come on. What's he doing? I'm trying to go fast. What's he doing? What is that man doing on that crazy motorcycle? Uh, okay, come on. Learn to steer. Learn to steer. Try telling that to my bike, dude. <laughs> what? Like, what was that? What was that job that just happened there? Insane. He's All right. That motorcycle's coming for us. Come on. You suck. Oh my god.
walked, I know, right? Just casually walks in front of me. I think he was trying to fight me. I think. <laughs> just sees me going, oh, into the bike. He's just like, oh, hello, how's it going? <laughs> oh. Oh, fuck. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> oh, dude. Crazy shit. All right. One more attempt. If I can't make that jump, I'm just going to skip this one. We'll get a different card. It turned out the guy was actually blind and deaf. And he didn't know what was happening in front of him. He could feel the vibrations of the black in the ground. He was like, ooh, I wonder what this is. All of a sudden pain, then death, basically. All of a sudden, ow! And then death. Honestly, not a terrible way to go. If you're blind and deaf, like, Jesus. God damn. Okay. Slowly back into it. Back that ass up. Into the checkpoint. Oh, God. Come on. Yes! Finally! Poggers? I actually have this now. Alright. Huh? Yeah, I know. Right? All I had to do was threaten the game that I would skip it. I was like, oh, right, fine then, fine. I'll act like a normal bike for once. My Again, as the legendary philosopher Little Bow Wow said in Tokyo, uh, Fast and Furious Tokyo Drift, if you ain't in control, sorry, if you ain't out of control, you ain't in control. Come on, get on the bike, 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 come on, get on the bike. That's exactly, dude. Exactly. All these people like, this man is out of control. Like, no, dude. I mean, I, I have the exact correct amount of control right now. Not too much, not too little. The perfect amount of control. Oh, my God. Bruh. <laughs> Oh my god. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh no. No. Oh no. 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 Come on! Come on! 
god! That's so bullshit! I got thrown from the bike out of the range of the fucking bike. Oh my lord! Are you kidding me? <laughs> fuck this, I'm done with this mission. I'm moving on. <laughs> Holy fuck. That's some bullshit. Okay, so the, where we're heading to is... Yeah. Yeah, I know, right? Yeah, it, it was going too well and the game just like... So this one, we're gonna get the car from point A to point B. But the car is running out of fuel, so we have to refuel it on the way. So we have to pull into two gas stations. So we're gonna yeah we're gonna pull into service stations along the way to get free fuel. This will be interesting. Okay. Huh. <sighs> there is something wrong with old Betty. She's a beautiful rider and would break my heart to scrap her. She's all yours if you manage to get her over to my mechanic across town. Okay. Oh god. Now so it's gonna adjust my seat. <gasps> Ow. I can't wait till I get my new chair, dude. This chair is fucked. It just has like no back support. The back support's fucked up. The padding in the seat's fucked up. That's the first one we're going to is on this corner. Drew for the chair, yeah, dude. The funny thing is I've only had this chair for like a year and a bit. This is a cheap chair. So I'm, oh, I'm ordering a, I ordered a secret lab, it should be getting here in November. That's pre order because they're all sold out. Because of all the people working from home ordering chairs. There we go, fill up. Fill me up. You good? Good? Why isn't it driving? What the fuck? Uh... It's... What the fuck? What the fuck is wrong with this car? Fill it up? Yeah, fill it up. What the fuck? What the hell's wrong with this thing? What the fuck? All right, screw it. Car must die. Piece of shit. That was so weird. It must have bugged out or something. Has a share for eight years. Damn. Yeah, yeah I'm so keen for my secret labs. Shit. Hey, Reboot, how's it going? Fortnite's fuel mechanics way better than this, dude. I don't know what happened there. Oh. Herman Miller. Ah, oh, yeah. Yeah, that's, uh, those, those are a bit pricey. Those are a little bit pricey. Just a smidge. Just a smidge pricey. Uh. Let's try it again. Hey, 
you say to me? Huh? You call me elbow guy? Do I look like I have elbows? Shut up. <laughs> the fuck you say, you little shit? Exactly, yeah, dude. I mean, if the car refuses to work, the car refuses to fill up with fuel to blow it up. 100% totally reasonable. Fill it up. Fill it up. There we go. I don't know what the hell happened there. That was weird. That was weird. All right. So we want to pop into here. On the way. Let's refuel. Because essentially, from what I can tell, the fuel tank is basically leaking. Let's go. Someone shot a couple of holes in it. Cough might have been me. <laughs> on the previous attempt. And uh, we've got to refill it along the way multiple times. Cut low key, can't want to glitch again. Oh my god. Dude, don't do this to me. Don't do this to me, man. I want this car. This car that doesn't look like it's from the 30s. Looks more like it's from the 40s. Almost already empty. What is this? Alright, refill. Alright, so... Where's the next gas station? I guess there? Yep. So go to this one. And then to that one. And then that should be enough to get us to the spot. Alright, let's go. Go, 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 go! Gotta go fast! Oh man. Move! I hope bumping it doesn't. I hope it crashing into people doesn't uh, leak more fuel. And that's being a little bit more important. Move! I'm almost out of fuel! I need to take a piss at the servo! This is the driving to work and you've got diarrhea challenge. So you're stopping off at every petrol station on the way. Oh my god, move, 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 move. Oh god. Oh. Just made it. <laughs> Dude. Oh boy. Okay. Um Oh. Make up your mind, game, which way am I going? Come on, boy. <laughs> Make it to 7-Eleven, dude. I know, right? <laughs> Wait, because you're out of fuel or because you're gonna shit yourself? <laughs> Wait, 7-Elevens don't have toilets. Nani? Bruh, what are you doing? You're cutting me off. Oh, you're a piece of shit. You're a piece of shit. You might've ruined this. You might have completely ruined this challenge. And now Tommy's gonna shit himself. <laughs> Fuel, okay. <laughs> yes. Did you see that? Fuel. Bruh. Oh, idiot. 
Ah, shit. No. 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 <laughs> no. I got cucked by the blue car. Okay. <laughs> Restart. Oh, eyes. Hmm. Interesting, interesting racing challenge, this one. Very interesting. We had the, take this car, then drive to this spot, then swap it with this car, take that car to this spot, then swap it with this car, the switcheroo. Switcheroo four or five time mission. We've had the drive this dragster around the city and don't crash it and get it to a different spot. And now we've got the, we had the stupid annoying bike challenge. And then we've got this one, which is the, my car has a leak in the gas tank and I refuse to patch it up with some gum, some chewing gum. And therefore you must stop at every gas station on the way. I literally played through the entire game and got almost all the collectibles and never had to refuel the car. And then this car is just like the ultimate gas guzzler. All right, oh. Go, 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 go. Fill it up, fill it up. F1 style. Let's get 10 dudes out here, refueling it, changing the tires, ready to go. Get the pit crew. Get Tommy's professional Italian mafioso pit crew out here. Dude, dude, uh -huh. try not to crash. I feel like crashing makes you lose a little bit. Trying to avoid that as much as possible. Wait, I didn't mark this one. Yep, and I'm breaking all of them. Cause YOLO. Shut up. The city has laws and I'm ignoring all of them. Okay, you ready? Go, 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 go! Oh boy, oh boy. Channel, you're in a baby driver. Put your put your AirPods in. Put your AirPods in, dude. It's 1930s. I don't care. Put your AirPods in. Focus. Oh god. there. Hey! It's alright. Almost killed that person. And we go to this one. Your fault. Don't at me, bro. Don't at me. Alright, this way is actually a lot better. I should have gone. I should have gone this way instead. Right, so down. Hunt. 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 Oh, yeah, this is way better. This way is way better. Go. 
Nice. All right, we're going to do it, man. The feeling. I got that feeling. Ooh. And tonight's going to be a good night. Oh, no. No, bro. What are you doing? You're killing me. Shiver me timbers. All right, here we go. Nice, dude. Look at this. Jesus Christ! Yeah, boy, I fucking nailed it. I fucking nailed it! Awesome. Alright, what's the next one? Uh... Okay. Oh god. <laughs> yep. Nailed it. First try. 100%. Definitely didn't require multiple attempts. Alright. We're doing speed, guys. We're doing the movie Speed. Oh god. I hate this car so much. <laughs> It's fast as fuck, but it controls like an asshole. <laughs> yeah, we're, we're gonna do the movie speed. We have to drive, I believe it's a bus, around. If we go under 30 miles an hour, the bus explodes. We're literally doing speed. I'm surprised they haven't made a, like, a remake of Speed yet. <laughs> like, of all, like, the, you know, 90s movies to remake, Speed is going to be, like, top, honestly. Make, uh, make Speed 3, but with Keanu Reeves, instead of that random dude who kind of, but he was, like, just, like, a, a milk toast version of Keanu Reeves. Alright. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, boy. No, you don't. You don't need any help. Shut up. Shut up. Everything's fine. There's no crazy dude in a white suit driving his dragster around. Oh, gee. Calm down. Shut up, NPCs. Be quiet. My nemesis has rigged a bus to explode if it drops below a certain speed, and he's challenged me to prevent it. Keep the bus going faster than 30 miles per hour while I have the bomb defused. Okay? Great. How do you expect me to board the bus? How how do I board the bus if it won't stop? Alright. Uh... Alright, I'm gonna catch up the bus then. I'm gonna have to jump onto the bus somehow. Oh man. Alright, this is gonna be interesting. Now I'm gonna drive it as well. Keep it above 30. Jesus. Alright. Here we go. There we go. Ah! 
Okay. Let's keep above 30. This shouldn't be too hard, honestly. Just drive it in the outback. Well, listen to that squeaky. Oh, man. All right. Yeah, this doesn't seem too hard. It's just like the squeaking of the bus, man. Like every turn I make, it's like. <laughs> Listen to it. Oh my god. <laughs> Sounds like the worst bus ever. Worst bus ever. Okay, cool. It's maintaining above 40. Bus going up the hill. Son of a bitch! I was like, get to the flat part! Come on! <laughs> oh man. Oh man. That's rough. That's rough. All those women and children on that bus. Yeah, this seems easy until I was like, maybe I can go up the hill with the bus. No, I can't. That's a bad idea. Hey, Kitty. Who do you think you are? I'm the boss, boss. All right, let's go. Get in the vehicle. Go, 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 go. I uh, hope you have a good rest. Yeah, man, no worries. Appreciate it. You have a good one, dude. You take care of yourself, and I'll catch you later, man. Uh, let's go. Come on. We're catching this time. No, you don't. You're not going to cut me off, buddy. I'll tell you what, boy. I'll tell you what. At least I'll have a bit more time driving in the city. Alright. There we go. Nice. Alright. Uh, shit. I might follow the same route, but I'll go left instead. I feel like that would be safe. Oh, maybe. Is that the. Oh. Wait. Oh, I could get onto the airport. If I could get into the airport and just do laps on the strip, that might be the way to do this, eh? Fuck okay, it, let's try it. Let's see what happens. Shut up, are you idiots? Boss! The boss is gonna bomb on it! Shut up! Get out of the way! Alright, so it's the first left. Easy peasy. Easy peasy. Position on the seat. Ah, shit. What's the time? It's nearly three? It's nearly, seriously nearly three already. Damn. There you go. 
All right. Alright, let's see. Hopefully the airport isn't blocked up. Come on, let me through. Ugh, shit. Alright. <laughs> Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, you fuck. Why is the airport blocked? That's bullshit. All right, and then I guess I'll just follow the same route, but I'll take the left route, which is going downhill instead of uphill. <sighs> Unfortunate. All right. Oh my god. Sorry. Oh, Mi dispiace. There we go. Shut up. 